Hi everyone, in this video we will learn the most important components in a vehicle. It's an engine. From all types of engines, four-stroke engine is the most widely used, especially on motorcycles. Then how does it work? See the following animation. First, we must understand the working principle of a four-stroke engine. In simple terms, four strokes means four stages. That means, a four-stroke engine is an engine that has four stages in one cycle. Why does the engine have four stages? To answer this, you must understand internal combustion. Internal combustion is the basis of all engines used in vehicles. This combustion occurs in a closed cylinder. The result of a combustion is heat and expansion energy. Expansion energy has the power to push. What if there is a piston in a closed cylinder? Of course, when the combustion occurs, the expansion power will push the piston down. Then under the piston, there is crank mechanism. The function of the crank mechanism is to convert the vertical motion of the piston into rotational motion. So, after the piston moves down, the piston immediately returns to the top. Then, combustion occurs again. So the piston gets power again. That's what makes the engine work continuously. Back to question, why are there four stages? The stages aim to condition the combustion to occur in a sustainable manner. So the four stages are, intake stroke, compression stroke, combustion stroke, and exhaust stroke. The intake stroke is the stage for entering air and gasoline into the cylinder. In this stroke, the piston moves down. And the intake valve is open. The movement of the piston, makes the cylinder space enlarged. So that the air and gasoline are sucked into the cylinder. Compression stroke is a stage for pressing a mixture of air and gasoline. The purpose is to increase the pressure and temperature of the mixture. Why should it be increased? If the temperature and pressure are high, then the mixture is more flammable. So we only need a small spark from the spark plug to burn. In addition, it also aims to ensure that the combustion has a large expansion power. To do it, the piston moves upward. And both valves are closed. It made the cylinder space shrink, and the mixture was compressed. Combustion stroke is a step to do combustion. To do it, the spark plug will release a spark. When the combustion occurs, the expansion power pushes the piston down. Finally, there is an exhaust stroke. This stage aims to remove the residual gas to the muffler. To do it, the piston moves upward and the exhaust valve is open. The movement of the piston pushes the remaining combustion gases out into the muffler. After performing the exhaust stroke, the engine returns to the intake stroke and the cycle continues to repeat. The things you can't forget, there is valve mechanism. This mechanism used to drive both valve to open in the correct timing. To do it, valve mechanism use cams hafts. As you see, the cams haft has a cam. This cam, will push the valve when they are contact. To rotate the cams hafts, we need two sprocket located in cams haft and crank shaft. And we need a chain to connecting the sprockets. So, when the crank shaft rotate, the cam's haft will rotate following the crankshaft speed. That's an explanation of how the four-stroke engine works. Subscribe our channel and stay tuned to the next video.